Okay, so this is a, a Intel 8224 uh, chip. Um, it was in a ceramic package so I could pop the top off. So let's uh, put it in the microscope and see what it looks like. Okay, uh, let's see if I can get this better in focus. There we go. So some of the wand uh, bond wires were ripped off when I popped the package off, but you can see the chip there. Uh, looks pretty cool. I can zoom in on this or not. Mm. I think I'll show you this uh, with this microscope and I'll change microscopes. We'll try to get it in closer. But um, it's a chip. It's uh, Let's take a measure it. Uh, let's see. How big is it? It's pretty big. It's about two millimeters square. Two millimeters by two millimeters. So four square millimeters. Um, so it's pretty big. Uh, back in the day, they didn't have very good lithography, so uh, yeah, that's about all she did. Um, yeah, let's 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 uh, change microscopes and see if we can get can get in even closer. All right, there we go. Uh, I have it on my um, I think it's my 10x objective. Yeah, my 10x uh, Olympus. Um, dark field, uh, poor man's dark field uh, microscope, and uh, you can see uh, the writing on it. It's an Intel 1975. So yeah, this is one of the original originals. Uh, very nice. And focus it a little better here. Um, not exactly sure what all the different uh, areas of the chip are. Um, There's definitely an oscillator section somewhere that might be here in the corner, and uh, then there's a some type of shift register, uh, maybe here right in the center. That's the uh, the divide by nine circuit. So there's nine flip flops, and um, it uh, does a state machine uh, to do the non-overlapping clocks. And then this section over here, well, I don't know. I'm just kind of guessing. Uh, it looks kind of messy over here, so I'm not sure what all that is. There's there's some other circuitry on the 8224 for reset and uh, and other things, so that might be stuff I don't know about. Um, but yeah, it's kind of fun. It's fun to look at chips. It's nice to get packages that you can open up easily. Good picture of a bond wire there. And you can see that the uh, Intel 1975 there, the copyright, um, underneath it is the 3224. That's probably the, the, the uh, nu numerical de designation for the chip itself. So the package, packaged part might be an 8224. Maybe the package itself is a 5224. The chip is a 3224. Maybe the schematic is a, is a 1224. Um, so a lot of uh, companies do do it that way. So. Not surprising to see a 3224 here on the chip. If I uh, get the Russian parts, and the Russian parts are easily opened up, they might be a plastic package, so they might not be easy to open up. But if they are easy to open up, I'll open up a Russian part. We'll look inside and see if, it's, see if we see the exact same thing, how, how closely they match, to match that. Anyway, thought you'd be uh, interested in that.